guys, it's Brittany. I wanted to come on here and film an empties for you all. It's been a month or so since I filmed a video and I've really needed to get this up. I've just been busy this month. I know we had our um, town's festival the first week of this month. I was sick the first week of this month. And um, I had to get some things taken care of about me moving this month. So I've been pretty busy. So I'm going to show you guys what I've collected in the past couple months from um, September and this month. And I've got quite a bit of stuff to show you guys, so I'll just get started. Oh, and I got my hair cut. If y'all haven't seen, I'm going to have to get it cut again because it's growing out. I got it cut the um, last week of September, so I'm going to get it cut um, the end of this month. So I guess I'm just going to have to get cut once a month. <clears throat> Excuse me, I like it pretty good. There's my doggie. Mommy's baby. So I'm just going to get into this. And sorry if my background is distracting. This apartment's tiny. Like right there's my... Um, dining room, and then there's my kitchen, and this right here is the living room, so, um, I'm just going to get started. The first thing I have in here is this True Living Spice Market and Vanilla Sugar. There it is, and I really liked the way these smell in the container, but once I burned them, mm, mm they smell delicious inside this, but they didn't have a really good throw at all, so... If you see these, it's a, you get a big bunch for $3.50, but I wouldn't recommend these. The next thing I have is this candle. It's um, the Better Homes and Gardens Brazilian Bamboo Woods. I um, have two top burners. I have one in my kitchen and one in my bedroom. And the one in my bedroom has like a removable thing you can sit like candles on. So, as you can see, I um, burnt the rest of the um, wax inside of it. Oh, and this smelled really, really good. It had a real good throw. The wax that I reused even had a good throw, and it smells real manly. And like I said, I've been loving manly scents for some reason. The next thing I have is this Woodcraft candle from the Dollar Tree. It was in Granny Smith Apple. It looks like that. I wouldn't recommend this. It has no throw at all whatsoever. I know the, um, the Crackling Fire kind had, um, a really really good throw and I loved it but these mm -mm, I would not repurchase that next one I have is another woodcraft and apple chai same thing I wouldn't repurchase it the next thing I have is this starlight's heirloom pumpkin this didn't really have a throw at all either and it smells really good inside of it and I even burnt the rest of the um, wax out but I wouldn't recommend it. Save your buck. Now this one, it comes in this little tin, and it was a dollar from um, the Dollar General. It's in pumpkin latte. This was an excellent candle for a dollar. It had a real good throw. I used up the wax inside, and yeah, I would recommend it. The next one I have is this Peaceful Waters from Walmart. It is by Mainstays. It didn't really have a throw either. It smells kind of blueberry -y and I wouldn't recommend it either. The next one is Island Waves. This had a pretty good throw and it smells real clean smelling. And I used up the wax on it also. This one I believe was a um, one of those Air Fresh I believe it was. It was um I think it was Dollar Tree Candle in um, Fresh Cotton. It smells pretty good in here, but it didn't have a throw either. And that's how much I've used of it. And keep in mind, I've collected these candles for a while. This next one I've showed you I've had for over a year. And this one is the Holiday Scented Candle from the Dollar General. I got it like for half off of three fifty, I think it was. It's in the Scent Winter Wonderland. It smelled good, but I got tired of smelling it after a while, and I used all of it up. Like I said, I have a ton of um, candles and tarts, and I also have a few beauty items. This one is probably one of my fav all-time favorite wax melts. It's in Coastal Woods by Mainstays. Oh my god, it smells so good. It's real manly. If you don't like manly scents, you wouldn't like this. 
but I absolutely loved the scent, and yes, I would recommend that for sure. <clears throat> the next one is True Living from uh, Dollar General. It was the um, Ocean Breeze. I got it on clearance for a buck fifty. It smelled pretty good. I would recommend it. And the next one I have is Fresh Melon. I didn't like it. I didn't have a good scent. I wouldn't recommend that one. I think this is the last candle alive. It's another Woodcraft. It's in the Paradise Spa. It had no throw at all. Absolutely whatsoever. Oh no, I'm sorry. It had this Glade Mocha and Chestnuts. It smelled pretty good. Um, I would recommend it. I wouldn't pay full price for it. Like I got this one on sale. But I would recommend it if you could get it um, on clearance or something. I used up this Dove Hair Therapy Cool Moisture Shampoo. I love this. I love anything Dove. Like my favorite body wash is Dove. I probably won't ever use anything else unless um, I just get gifted something. But even though the Dove is... Sorry, um, Chevelle sees somebody outside. But, um, but, um, for the, um, what is it called? The Dove, um, she's distracted me, sorry. But anyway, for the Dove body wash, even though it's like $6, you get a huge bottle and it lasts forever, so, and it smells great. It lasts on your skin. Most body washes that I um, have used before, they don't last on my skin for some reason. So, yeah, I love a dove. So, yes, so I would repurchase that. And I've purchased this stuff tons and time and time again. It is the Assured Feminine Wash. I use um, Feminine Wash on my Lady Bits. So, you don't get a yeast infection or any kind of that junk that you don't want. I haven't used this up, but I am getting rid of it. I don't like the way it tastes or the smells. It's just a cheap, um, tap black stick, Girl Scout Stin Mint. Don't really like it. So I'm getting rid of it. Or no, actually, it is Lip Smacker. I'm sorry. But yeah, I don't like it. I wouldn't repurchase it. I finished up a. I guess this is a travel size, small size of the Warm Vanilla Sugar Body Lotion from Bath & Body Works. I've had this for a while, so I want to get through it. I like it. It's okay. I prefer the thicker type um, lotions, whether it be um, like a cream or a, um, like a, a butter. But I like the scent of it, but after a while it gets old, so I'm glad I'm done with that. And as for this stuff, this is Nivea Visage, 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 I don't know how you say that, Advanced Vitality Cream. It looks like that. And I wouldn't repurchase this. It stinks so bad. And I've got a huge amount left in it, but I just can't stand the smell. And I have a no-show one-touch concealer by Jane. I've used all of it up that I can get out. I'm really sad this is gone because I loved it. But it was time for it to go and I have more concealers I need to get through. And I also finished up, I'm getting rid of it anyway, this um, CoverGirl Eye Enhancers in Sparkle. No, wait. Plum Satin, Confetti Shimmer, and Pink Chiffon. I'm getting rid of it just because it's you can't really work with the colors anymore. And I'm just over it, so I'm getting rid of it. So, that's everything I have in this little container. As you can see. So, I'm going to go ahead and get off here. And I will see you guys in my next video. Hopefully you enjoyed this. And hopefully I will have another one to show you all soon. Bye guys.